How we doing? Hi, El Paso Grandma. Your package is in the mail, dear Karma. Hello, hello. Your package is in the mail, too. So I finally added up all of the jewelry, the weights from uh, Thursday night. And it was the most jewelry we've ever done on a Thursday night. I'll wait till everybody else gets in here and I'll tell you how much it was. If nobody cheats. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty crazy. God bless my post office, man. Girl, you didn't even come close to having the largest order, let me tell you. You only had one box. <laughs> there was somebody who had two large flat rate boxes. which was probably, it was over 40 pounds. So, hey all, hey, um, I was trying to find a giveaway and then I got distracted, hang tight. Let me see here. Let me see here. What do I have to give away? I mean, I have a lot of stuff for sure. Let's see here. We'll do a little bracelet bundle. Let's do a little bracelet bundle. Actually, you know what? We'll do this. This is an earring and... Oh, it's an earring set. Earring set. That will be our giveaway. There we go. And I think we're pretty much set. So I picked up over a hundred pounds of jewelry today. Hey, horsey. Oh, it was a good one too, horse lover. Oh my gosh, she had great, she had some really, really great um, mystery bags tonight. They were awesome. I didn't get any because I was getting ready for my show and it was hard for me to keep up with the bidding and pay attention. But, um, yep, yeah, she's doing the buyer's giveaway right now. She just did a quick um, 10 bag mystery show. I literally bought so much stuff at the swap meet between my jewelry guy uh, Friday morning and the swap meet today. Oh my goodness. It's crazy. Oh, I was going to finish putting this in.
Hey, Thrift and Gold, how are you doing? I was just telling Horse Lover that I have so much cool stuff tonight. Oh, thank you. I, um, it took me a while to get ready tonight. I had to finish up Thursday night stuff. Um, it was the biggest Thursday night was the most poundage of jewelry I've done in one night. Yep, I just literally found it in the box, so I snagged it up. I've been um, I've been uh, sorting through one of the boxes that I picked up yesterday while I was watching Andrea's um, live and getting ready. It is gorgeous. Look at that. It is pretty. Check this one out, too. Safety chain. Um, there's no, it's not marked from what I could tell. I don't see any. My mom found a couple of J. Crew pieces today. Um, I'm not exactly sure where they are though. What is this? It kind of does look like, as a matter of fact, did I sell you a J. Crew that looked like that? Because I feel like I may have. Because I've had a couple of those before. Seven seconds for the giveaway, my friends. Ah, who's it going to be? Plus bus, congratulations. Hey, woohoo! Oh, welcome in, my friends. Welcome in, guys. All right, you guys just popped in after the givey, so let's do another one real quick. Let me see. What else do we have in here? I'm just digging through the box here. Welcome in. We have lots of cool stuff tonight. Oh, here we go. This is pretty. <laughs> And I got a fancy new bracelet hanger to that way I can display display play up bracelets for you guys. So we're hey Carolyn. All right, let's do another giveaway real quick. And this is gonna be our giving. This bracelet it says love and Inside the bag with it, it says this circle of hope and faith was inspired by your strength and humbled by your courage. And that is what will be our giveaway. Hey, Bran, how you doing? Guys, I'm so excited. We have so much cool stuff tonight. 
I have trays and trays and trays of stuff tonight. So, horse hair bracelet, bottom middle. I don't know if it's horse hair or if it's cow. We can pull it off and look at it. Honestly, I don't even know how to tell. So here's my question, my friends. Do you want to bundle tonight? Because we can do a uh, we can do a bundling show where if you bundle the item is four dollars and then we'll run the auction at five for somebody to pick it up or we can just run it everything at four and let you guys bid on everything at four a monkey fur coat <laughs> horsey's like just say say yes run it for okay and then so we're gonna do um treasure hunting tomorrow night and then monday tuesday and wednesday we're gonna do bundling all three days this week and then we're going to do <laughs> and then on um, thursday we're going to do um the five pound lots so there's two of you who know how many pounds of jewelry that i sent out from thursday night's live would anyone like to guess how many pounds of jewelry i sent out in five pound lots from thursday night the person who's closest i will give a prize to no, no. If if you know what it is, y'all aren't even close. We're talking triple digits. I am serious. I am serious. Mr. Beard said 180. Horse Lover says 175. 400 is too high. Two oh five is getting closer. Keep going. Two oh fives are clo closest. It was 209 pounds. Two hundred and nine pounds. And I believe Boy Mama was the closest. <laughs> I added it all up this morning. So boy mama, if you um, have a package today, I will add something free in there for you. But more than likely, everybody's gonna get free stuff because I always do free stuff for everybody. Yep, boy mama had 210 first, correct. Yep, it wasn't, but I didn't specify without going over. So next week, when we're guessing, I will specify the rules a little bit uh, closer. Den 686. Congratulations. Give me just a second, guys. The computer is not cooperating. All right. 
So let me write that down on a sticky note real quick. First of all, let me adjust my All right. You changed it. You're done selling for a while. What? Oh, no. Let me look here. Make sure I get the name right. Den 686. All right. So. Den, thank you for the follow. So horse lover wanted to see this. So Genuine leather. This is, this is definitely um, something. Let me give you, a, I don't know where my, hold on. I don't know where my ruler is. What the hell? Oh, okay. Sorry. This is, so this is um, anywhere between seven and eight inches because it's got the three um, buttons. So anywhere between seven and eight inches and it is running for four. Yeah, it's really nice. I will be back in just a second. I forgot to grab my bags. I was so mesmerized by my uh, new jewelry that I forgot to finish setting up my table. I just got so excited, guys. I got so excited, I forgot setting everything up. Brian, nice pickup, congratulations. That's what happens when you get all excited. I have a, what is, what are you saying, Carolyn? I have a jewelry boner right now. Excuse my language. <laughs> All right. You guys don't even know. I mean, you do know, but you don't know. Like, <laughs> um, the last two days have been uh, very exciting in my jewelry life. And I have gotten a lot of really fantastic things. Jewel erection. I like it. I'm working on it. Don't brush me. <laughs> Don't stress me out, woman. 
Anybody want to see any of the bracelets that are up here? We can run through some of those real quick. Well, I think uh, Karma wanted to see the flowers. We've got a lot of really pretty bracelets. Yes, the flower. So I have been buying a hundred pounds a week from my jewelry guy. My goal as of starting Monday is to buy 200 pounds a week. <laughs> Bran, you got uh, muted. <laughs> oh my gosh. So if you think that you've been seeing a lot of jewelry up to this point, we're about to double it. This is at six with no stretch. And this even with stretch, you can hardly even tell it's getting stretched. And uh, we're at seven. Well, come in on Thursday nights, Peculiar. All right, my darlings. This is running next. So now that I've hit my 200 pound goal on Thursday nights, uh, I guess the new goal is to hit 300 pounds on Thursday night. Did you win? You won all kinds of great stuff at Andrea's. Shebug, thank you for your first purchase with me and congratulations. It is really cute. We'll roll through the those real quick. Let's do that. Because there's some really cute stuff up here. And I have my Presidium on. And I wanted to check this bracelet before I ran it. All right, what do we got here? All right, here is a beautiful cuff, cuff bracelet. I don't see it being signed anywhere. These stones are nephrite jade. These are nephrite jade. Very beautiful. Um, I just so you guys know, uh, this is probably about a six and a half. Um, I don't clean any of the jewelry. This stuff comes from auction in the box. Look at that. That is gorgeous. Um, so you have to give them a spa day when they get to you. Okay. Nephrite Jade cuff bracelet. Beautiful little can't clamper. Camper clamper. Very cute. I like it. Oh, I need to fix the time to 15 seconds. Yeah, this is gorgeous. Nice pickup. Look at this beast right here. So all the way out at the last clasp, we are looking at 7.75. Woohoo! And 7.75 to 6.75. There's an inch on here, so you can adjust it down by a half an inch a couple of times. So pretty. 
it is running and I forgot to change the time again. This is beautiful. What a chunker, a beautiful chunker. Exactly, exactly. And you know what? If you know this crowd, you know you'll you'll figure out real quick. We don't mind talking at all, right, Horsey? We're here for a, a, a good time and a long time. Nice pickup, sweetheart. And I don't have anything to do tomorrow until the afternoon or whenever I decide to go over and see Mama. She didn't come in. She must have not have stayed in Andrea's. Yeah, I thought so too, Horsey. absolutely we're all friends here no none of us get very worked up about anything so we're super chill all right look at this cute another uh clamper look at the flower leaf on the back this is so pretty Yes, please be careful. This is, I love this bracelet. Karma, are you here? I found another flower. Uh, let's see, what are we looking at on here? About a, about a 6.75 to a 7 on here. <laughs> I saw the flower. I love this. It's so pretty. I am so excited for treasure hunting tomorrow night too. Yeah, it's going to be good. It's going to be a good time. Yeah, we're, we have a busy week. I plan on going live every night until Friday. I got to save up that uh, RV down payment, my friends. Oh, that's going to be fun. Live from the office, huh? Dan, 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 nice pickup. Thank you so much. What a beauty. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited too. Right now, I'm focused on saving that. So... I just got to go get it. <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's do this one next because this is so beautiful. I'm going to check this real quick. So this is glass. I know me too, horsey. And I'm it's so hard for me to find bras because I'm well endowed. So, you know, without getting a, a grandma style bra. All right. Here we go. Shoot. The chain got hooked inside the bracelet. Hold on just a second. All right. I don't see any markings, guys. Did anybody see something that I may have missed? Because I'm not perfect, and sometime... 
Yeah. All right. Anywho, let's get a size on this. This is going to be about another 6.75 to 7. That uh, centerpiece is glass and it is gorgeous. She needs a spa day, but she is beautiful. I would keep this if it was my size. Oh, I love it. Girl, don't we all need a spa day? Yes, it is her creative way. <laughs> Thank you for your bids, everyone. Thank you so much for coming in and hanging out with me tonight. I'm so excited. I've got so much cool stuff. $2 starts on bundling tomorrow night. Bram! Nice pickup. That is gorgeous, my friend. Congratulations. <gasps> Yay! You know, I get so excited for you guys to get your um, Thursday night lots now because I just want to hear what you find in them. Let's see. I'm going to test these, this bracelets real quick. All right. <laughs> it's going on your permanent record. All right, we have three glass bracelets. These two are stretchy, and this one is adjusted by um, square knots. So three gorgeous glass bracelets, and they are running. Ooh, look at all that sparkle. Oh my gosh, look at that. Seriously though, that's almost too much. Is that too much sparkle? Never, I agree, sweetheart. Nice pickup, lots of sparkle. We got here. You know, guys, I gotta tell you, um, I'm kind of digging the spa music. Um, over the other music that I was playing. It sets a nice tone for us to just kind of cut up and have a good time. All right, my darlings. It's, it's kind of low. I don't have it too high. Um, here is a, a carnelian stretch bracelet with no stretch. We're sitting at 6.75 with no stretch. And let's add, um, let's add this beautiful bangle. And... We're going to add this big, thick bangle as well. And this one is a nice big one. It's an 8.75. So we got a variation of sizes there. But it's a nice little grouping. There we go. Three bracelets. Carnelian agate. And then 
two bangles. I love this carnelian. trying to turn it up. I got it on the wrong. here why don't we run these two together we've got this gorgeous clamper and we're gonna add this beautiful stretch piece on very pretty these two are running together Thank you, Brian. Very gorgeous. Excuse my sniffling. I really like this one. I really like them both, but this one really drew my attention earlier. have a bunch of sterling that I need to sell too. Maybe we'll do that tomorrow night as well. Den, nice pickup. Yay! I picked up the most fantastic rosary today. It is crazy. And I paid up for it. And I never pay up for anything, guys. I am cheap. I shouldn't say never. I'm very selective about what I pay up on. So we're going to do these two to ne together next. This uh, spiky part comes off. It's Velcro, so you can use the bracelet with or without it. And it's kind of a suede material. So going over it with like a, a clothing roller or something to get the uh, fuzz off is probably going to be necessary. Yes. And then this is fantastic. I just love this big old beast. Let's get some sizes for you. This one is an eight. And this one is also an eight. So these are both eights. And they are running. Yeah, when I saw this one with the spikes, I was like, oh my gosh, that's interesting. Thank you, Brian. Nice pickup. Very nice. Mm -hmm. 
Very cool. Oh, cool. I'm, I'm happy about that. All right, these next two are going to go together. These are acrylic, I think. Let's get a size with no stretch. 7.25. See, no stretch, 7. And they're easily go stretching all the way out without too much space on there. So uh, really, really nice. This one has kind of a uh, blue foiling into it. And this one is um, monochromatic gold on gold on gold. So these two are going to go together. Two bracelets. I like the blue. Sorry, guys, I thought I was going to sneeze. <laughs> Thought that was a sneeze coming on right there. All right. Next one is going to be this guy. It is gold tone. Then it has the silver uh, tone with the uh, laser engraving. That is 8.25. And that is going to go with this leather snap and that's a let's see six and a half and it'll go down to six and a quarter if you want it to and let's add this guy hi frank uh this is a six and a half easily stretchable without it being unattractive so these three are gonna go together and they are running. All right, I have so much stuff, you guys. I'm already saying I have too much stuff and I'm going to start doing 200 pounds instead of 100 pounds. I must be insane. Okay, hold on just one second. All right, nice pickup. No, we're not playing any metal. It stresses me out, man. I need some relaxing music. All right. I just found something very interesting. Interesting enough that we're going to bring the Presidium over to the... Uh, Screen. Here is our bracelet. Let's watch the hold on. You're not going to be able to see me. Um, yeah, you might. Um, no. Here we go. Purple. Purple stone. Hold on. It's slipping off. 
We are at an amethyst. And the white stone, the clear stone. Oh, I'm trying to, to get it in there, guys. It's really small. And that's what she said. <laughs> Hold on. Ah, shoot. Keep sliding off. I believe the clear is white topaz. Yeah, and I just can't get a good, I can't get a good uh, grab on it because it's small and the needle keeps. So I have to take this and put it here without it sliding or touching anything. So it's glass, the clear stones are glass or better. And let me get you a size. We are looking at a seven amethyst and glass or better. I think it's white topaz, but I can't say for hundred percent because I couldn't get a good read on it. Let's look at the back and see if we can find any markings on this guy. Let's zoom in. It looks real clean. I would venture a guess. I don't think this has ever been worn. I don't see any kind of markings on it and I did not test it at all. So let's look at the other side just to make sure all the stones are in place and then we will give it a run. All right. Looks good, guys. Looks good. Beautiful. All right. Are you ready? It is running. Man, that is gorgeous. Look at the light shining through there. Man, oh man, I told you guys I had some good stuff today. I was really excited. Hello, mother. Mom's here. Behave yourself, everybody. <laughs> Look at that. It's almost... Oh, the holly hag. I, it, oh my gosh. I can't even speak as I think that's so br beautiful. Andrea, nice pickup, sweetheart. Very nice. Thank you everyone for your bids. Yes, one time, uh, Karma. Were you here for that? It was a, a ring. Which I have done nothing with and is still sitting on my desk. Maybe I'll take it. I, I was going to take it to the jewelry guy. Yeah. You know what? I'll be honest with you. I wasn't nearly as excited about that as I was about finding the Hattie Carnegie or the Miriam Haskell. Because they're diamonds and they're everywhere and they're easy to find. But I mean... Vintage pieces like that, or the Vendome, like vintage pieces like that, I those are the ones that I get. Like, yay, it was a diamond, and that was really cool. But, 
you know, at the same time, especially the Hattie Carnegie a couple weeks ago, I literally almost cried. Yeah, I guess. I don't know. I just get more excited about the vintage stuff. All right, let's do um, let's do a couple more. Let's go to, to two more bracelet lots, and then we're going to move on to my trays. So we have this. Um, I saw some type of marking on it. Um, I think I might have one. I, oh, I do have some actually. I don't know what I did with them. They're on one of the, here we go. What is that? Made in Hong Kong. We have ourselves a vintage Hong Kong metal stretch bracelet. Yes, these are, especially because of the um, all metal. Anytime you can get a stretch bracelet that's all metal like that, you are doing good. Um, this is a six and let me see, it is stretching out all the way to, it could probably stretch past the 8.25. So a vintage Hong Kong piece. Let's check and make sure it's all there. Anytime I can pick up an all metal um, expansion bracelet like that, I do. And it is running. And this one's gonna go with it. Sorry, I got so excited about that. I forgot about this guy. It is a 6.5 with no stretch. Kind of a rose gold tone. I don't see any markings on it, but I just thought it was pretty. Thank you for the follow. I love that smoky tone in the rhinestones there. Den, thank you for the bid. Is it Brainiac? Is that what that is? Is that your name? I just now figured it out, I think. Nice. Brainiac. See, it only took me a few minutes to figure it out. I did handpick all these. This is all, these are all the singles that I picked out of my jewelry guys tray. So the only time I do $4 starts is when I handpick out of my jewelry guys tray and I'm picking, I, I'm paying more individually so that's why I start these a little bit higher. But yes, all this stuff I handpicked out of um, his stuff. Thank you. And I, and I picked a lot, let me tell you. Thank you. Now, these I did not. These I just found in the top of a box and they intrigued me. So I wanted to pull them out. Let's see if they're as cool as I thought they were. These are earrings. And I saw these and I thought, man, those look really sparkly. Wow. Anybody need New Year's Eve earrings? Holy moly. Let's get a measure on these. We're at just under four inches. Girl, and and then eat pizza. These are freaking gorgeous. Just under four inches. They are beautimous and they are running. Man, I wish I could wear these. These are so beautiful. Mm -hmm. 
I can't believe the sparkle on these. The color is amazing. Okay, the cows will probably think you're beautiful. And who cares anyway? I wear my jewelry for me and no one else. Yep. I wear the jewelry because I like to wear it, not to impress anyone. Nice pickup, Dan. Love those. Man, these gloves are just awful. They keep popping open on me. Mom, are you sorting? Oh, these are broken, so these are going to go in a bag and into the lot. Yeah, well, well of course. Um, you know, and plus, like being on whatnot, you can find some really, really fantastic things for really great deals. All right, we have a pair of, we're going to go with earrings again. These are rose quartz and garnet. They are posts. I'm not sure about the metal. It has not been tested, but these are rose quartz and garnet, and they are running. Little garnets right there. trying to figure out what kind of stones this next piece of jewelry is. Hang tight. I can't figure out if it's glass or stone. All right. We will put these away. And we have a necklace coming up. <laughs> and it is approximately 34 inches. 34 inches of nephrite jade. 34 inches of jade. Let's zoom in on our clasp. It says do play D A U P L A I S E. It does have a patent number. This is our clasp. This is a uh, doozy, my friends. This is a good one. Tall sir, how you doing? So thirty four inches of jade. Beautiful jade, lovely vintage jade necklace, and it is running. I got to change that time to 15 seconds, guys. How are you doing tonight, tall sir? Good, good, good to see you. Beautiful jade here. 34 inches of jade. I can't find my caliper. I bought one. Otherwise, I would give you guys the measurement on those beads. They sure are pretty, though. That clasp is really cool. Brainiac. Nice pickup. You have a show tonight, tall sir. Yeah, great buy. Well, I'll probably uh, scroll through. You're usually so busy when I'm in there. 
Um, but you always say hi. You you usually will see me. Yeah, you're a busy you're a busy dude. All right. I know. I hear that. All right, my friends, this is a beautiful, beautiful glass piece, glass necklace. It is a stunning red. It's about 24 inches. I try. Yes, sir, I do. We did, I did 209 pounds on Thursday. I forgot to take a picture to post on uh, Instagram. So this is, these are glass beads. This is really beautiful. Let's look at our clasp again. I am not familiar with that logo. I'm not familiar with that mark, but this is an all glass beaded necklace. Very, very beautiful. Have a great night. Have a good life. Thanks for stopping in. Listen to the glass. I don't know if you can hear it. I love the sound of glass necklaces when you wear them. Clicking against each other. Yeah. I love the color too. Brainiac. Very nice. Woohoo! She's a dancing queen. Oh my gosh, that is such a nice necklace. All right, let's do some more glass. I found quite a bit of glass this week. Let's do another one. Double checking on the Presidium real quick. This is cool. And I'm not putting stuff on my bust because I don't know where it is. So. All right. We have another glass necklace. This one is 20 inches, a little over 20 inches. So we're about 21 inches on my chest oh <laughs> look at here's our clasp this is 20 inches look at this glass this beautiful milky opal color that is 20 inches of glass and i think this is going to be a oh look at the glow on that it's glowing All right, beautiful 20 inch glass, gorgeous little opal like translucent film on there. Really, really pretty. I'm finally making the time to go get my nails done on Monday, you guys, because it's been so long since I've had any time to do it. Maniac. Nice pickup. All right, let's switch it up. Let's switch it up for a second. How about this gorgeous Clausene? Look at this beauty. Got the silky blue cording on the necklace, but this is going to be an easy switch out to put anything on here that you guys want. Beautiful Clausene necklace, and she is running for four. Boop, boop.
little butterfly, some blue and green flowers. Yeah, I was expecting um, you to get some fight on that too, Brainiac, for sure. Oh, here's a here's a good one. This is switching it up a little bit. Oh no, I don't usually do that. Okay, this is a Mac Allen. She is spicy. I like her too. She fits right in. I need to change the time though. Mac Allen. Mac Allen. Let's get a length on this puppy. We like spicy. I get a little spicy myself. Uh, this can go up to, what are we looking at? Between 12 and about 15 inches. It is a Mac Allen necklace, shepherd's hook clasp. Mac Allen, vintage. Yes, she is. She's pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Right. And we need to change our time on the next one. I'm used to running 15 seconds all the time. This 30 seconds is busting my butt. All right. Next, we have a little corded necklace with this acrylic with dried flowers inside. Again, easy switch over. Put this on a nice little sterling silver chain, and it's going to be awesome. I think it's already pretty awesome, actually. Love the dried flowers in there. That was quick, see? Holy smokes. All right, where is my ring sizer? So we have a ring, it is adjustable. Beautiful band, unadjusted. It, where did a feather come from? unadjusted we're looking at about a five and this is a beauty let me check and see if this is glass because i think this is glass indeed it is got a little glass piece right there it is sitting at a five. Oh, it totally would sitting at a five yep yeah, they would go together great and it is glass and it is running really really pretty uh band there's a little bit of plate wear around the edge right here it could just need a good cleaning though i'm going to be honest with you man that 15 seconds goes fast when you're not paying attention All right, we got another necklace coming. Here. 
here is a beautiful pink and white glass heart pendant just kind of like a see that pink swirl in the center right there and it's got a ribbon tie there is a clasp no it's solid it is solid I can see the little bubbles in there I love that pink in the center so pretty Brainiac. I like it. Yeah, it's adorable. I don't always pick up the glass pieces like that, but occasionally I just can't help myself. All right, we have a vintage piece coming up. I think what are we looking at here? Coro. Coro, Shepherd's Hook. beautiful coral necklace. Let me see if I can get a length on this for you. Up to 16 and a half, almost 17 inches on this, on the short strand. And this is a beautiful coral necklace. And she is running. These are plastic. Coro, C-O-R-O. -O. All right, my friends, this next one is a doozy. It is in, it's horse lover. You just mentioned you love glass. We're going to have a couple of glass pieces coming up right now. Here's the first one. This is our clasp. It's not signed, but it is absolutely beautiful glass. Look at all that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. She is a stunner. Let's see. So about 15 inches. Did you? Oh yeah, this is beautiful. Nice, heavy. That clasp is in great shape. I can't believe the weight on this. Got us a beautiful milk glass, double stranded, fantastic clasp. You can't get much better than that. Yeah. Karma, thank you for your bid. Absolutely stunning piece. These feel so good when you're wearing them because of the weight. It's almost, it's such a comfort. Karma, nice pickup, sweetie. Nice pickup. There's just something about, it's kind of like the, you know, weighted blankets for sleeping that um, it's calming.
All right, I think this is another glass piece. Indeed it is. <laughs> oh, I'm going to find you a good necklace then for that. This one is going to be 14 inches. And this is all glass. It is going to be nice and tight. Here's our clasp. But look at all this beautiful glass in here. Absolutely stunning. I love those facets. When I first picked this up earlier, congratulations, Brainiac. I thought it might be plastic, but then when I got it in my hand, I thought, no, no, this is definitely glass. All right. Let's do another glass piece. This one is has an extender on it and it is at the shortest is going to be about 11 inches and at the longest we are looking at what is this 16 inches We have a shepherd's hook. I don't see any markings on it. But look at this glass. Yeah. It's really, really pretty. And it, I think I said up to 16 inches. So it looks like the larger stones have the AB and the small stones in between do not. She's pretty. Brainiac, nice pickup. She's pretty. All right. Let's see what else I have back here. Yes, for sure. <laughs> A classy grandma. Well, you're a grandma. We're not dissing you. Listen, I got to tell you that my grandmas were bad asses and I would love to be compared to them any day of the week. Because they were awesome. Oh, are you working on your website? Yay, how exciting. All right. Have another glass piece coming up. I've got a lot of glass today. We are looking at about 17 inches. 17 inches with a three and a half inch extender. Hi, Joni. And this beauty is glass. 
I really wish I had a bust, but I don't. So these are glass and they are pretty and it is running. This is heavy. It's a nice heavy piece. So is this glass? Den. Thank you so much for your bid, you guys. Appreciate it. Love on LLC. Hello, my friends. Dan, nice pickup. Beautiful piece. The next necklace is 17, about 16 and a half inches. Barrel clasp, hematite with a beautiful blue cat eye. Hematite and cat eye necklace. It is running. Oh, those milk glass cameos. Yeah. Yeah, it is, isn't it? I love the blue. All right, my friends. I don't know much about watches. I'm just going to run this because I honestly don't feel like dealing with it. I do not know if it works. It looks like it's in pretty good condition. There is one tiny little crack in the screen or in the crystal right on the edge right there. Bulova 10 karat rolled solid plate. It was engraved for someone as a gift. USA Duchess 10 karat gold filled top. So it is rolled gold plated. Safety chain still there. Really beautiful um, band. And we're going to run it at four. Bulova, I cannot guarantee that it works. 10 karat rolled gold. All righty. What do we have here? I need to check this stone real quick. Yeah, it's pretty nice there, Miss Love. Whoopsie, I'm dropping stuff. Hold on, I can't be leaving this jewelry laying around on the floor. Let me see what I can find next. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. All right. So this is a beautiful porcelain necklace. Glazed beads. We are looking at about 30 inches. This is our clasp. And so 30 inches of these beautiful porcelain beads. It is knotted in between. 
it is a larger um, cording through. So these are glass slash porcelain. They did test on the Presidium about 30 inches. This is rather heavy and it is running. We'll be here. Thank you for the love. I see those hearts pop popping up. Thank you. All right. We have a Sarah Coventry necklace coming up next. The chain is 22 inches. 22 inch chain. This is our pendant. And... Oh, no, this is listener, not Sarah Coventry. Correct myself. This is a listener. L-I-S-N-E-R. It is articulating. It has three sections with a 20-inch chain, and it is running. Vintage listener. I really like that. This is going to move really nicely when you're wearing it. All right. I believe we got some glass here. Let me check it real quick. Indeed we do. Uh, we have three strands. Let me get a measure on it. The extender is extender is just under three inches. Without the extender, it's 16 inches. Okay, Doki. This is our clasp. And this is our beautiful glass. These are our beautiful glass beads. Gorgeous amber with some AB on here. Really, really pretty. It is running. This is glass. This reminds me of carnival glass, the amber carnival glass. Looking for the clasp. It doesn't appear to be marked, but it looks like it should be a signed piece. I'm going to be honest with you. All right, let's uh, measure this puppy up. With the extender, it's gonna be 16 inches on the short strand. I don't, it did not. You want to put it to the side for you, hon? Anyway, I feel like this should be signed, and I'm not showing it very well because I can't find my bust. It is running. It is not signed. Shepherd's hook clasp. These kind of look like sailboats. Sure, no problem. Then we've got these interesting beads. 
with these kind of softly curved pieces right here. Really interesting. Look down. <laughs> oh. Uh -huh. Silly lady. I was like, what are you talking about? It's actually a really nice piece. Nice bail. Let's see. It's really pretty. It's a nice heavy piece. Very nice. All right. I think we got one tray down. One tray down. We are moving and grooving. Woohoo. My nose is running. All right. So I do have this interesting necklace. It is rather long. I shall show it to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is about 35 inches, 35 inches. This is our clasp. This is our nice thick chain. I know, I know, I'll take them in a minute. And then this is our um, pendant. So I said 35 inches on the chain. And I'm gonna run that and I'm gonna go get my medicine. It's over on my nightstand. So this is running and I'll be right back. I'm back. My medicine is taken. MSQ, thank you so much for your purchase. MSQ, was this your first purchase with me? I thought this was pretty cool when I saw it. Well, thank you so much and congratulations. Very nice pickup. All right, guys, I am going to hit my um, tray. It does have some rosaries on it. Um, so I have some vintage plastic rosaries right now. Is anybody interested in vintage plastic rosaries? Because if you are, I will pull some out. If not, I will move on. Just let me know. <laughs> All right. I'll tell you what. This is what I have for vintage plastic rosaries right now. I actually, actually, you know what? I take that back. I have more, but I, they're in the other room. 
So I have a green and a yellow. If anybody is interested in any either one of these, let me know and I will run it. Otherwise, I am going to move on to the next tray. I actually picked up a whole lot of rosaries recently. I have more in the other room. So anybody need a turquoise or a yellow plastic rosary? I also have this. This is a little bit different. This is plastic, but it does have a metal cross and it does have an Italy stamp at the bottom. I have a ring on this tray. This is glass. Where is my ring sizer? I just had it. What'd you guys do with my ring sizer? I just had it. Ding it. Man, I'm telling you, if my head wasn't attached, it would fall off. Jeez. I'll put this to the side until I find my ring sizer. I have this little um, bag. We have a chain with a Guadalupe medallion. And we have a little bag. We'll do a little lot of these. This is a, I don't know, some kind of charm. Another, and inside the bag with all of this was this little guy right here. So anyway, all those are gonna go together. Let me see what else I can find over here. All right, I'm gonna go, you can have a Pope in your pocket. <laughs> All right, let me go grab my other tray since we finished a whole tray already. Dun, dun, dun. All right, I'll be right back. Lilo. Oh, okay. All right, so. I have another whole bag of vintage rosaries. If anybody is interested, you just let me know. Um, how about a pair of Monet earrings? Still on the original card. And it is a running. We're going to add a pair of Napier studs on there. Tin, tin, tin. Look at the cute. Sure, you got it. Absolutely. No worries. Don't be sorry. You know, I'm happy to rerun. I'm happy to do it. Mm. 
nice pickup. You are welcome. Next, we're going to run this cute little iridescent parrot. It says some Park Lane, I think. Is it Park Lane? Looks kind of like Park Lane. And this cute little enamel bear. We're going to run these two, two together. I feel like they need to be together. And they are running. So cute. Thrift and Gold, thank you so much. Nice pickup, Thrift and Gold. Let me turn my uh, medicine alarm off real quick. You're welcome. So cute. All right. Oh, we got some pretties. Pretties coming up, my friends. Let us check this out. We have a magnifying glass necklace. I know you guys love these. I found two of them today. This is 27 inches. Night. This is a 1928 barrel clasp. 1928 with a magnifying glass pendant. And it is running. Beautiful 1928. You guys, I can't keep these. You guys are always looking for them. So I pick them up whenever I can. 1928. Nice. I didn't even know it was 1928 till just now. I just grab them because you guys are always telling me you need them. Nice pickup, MSQ. Woohoo! All right, how about, let's see, what do I have here? We have another metal stretch bracelet. I don't see any kind of markings on it. It is alternating brush silver tone and then the chrome. And it has little gold pieces in the center. I have looked and looked and looked. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Let's uh let's zoom this in. Stainless steel and 18 carat, my lore Italy. So this is stainless steel and 18 carat gold made in Italy. Very nice. Very nice. Man, I looked at that a hundred damn times. 
Okay, not stretched. We are at seven. Ashley, and it an easy stretch up to 8.75 and still looks good. So a beautiful Italian all metal stretch bracelet. And it says stainless steel and 14 or 18 carat, right? 18 carat. And it is running. This is actually really nice. Feels good. Mary Lou, thank you for your bid. Mylor, 18 carat and stainless steel. Beautiful bracelet. The Holly Hag, very nice pick up the Holly Hag. How you doing, Ashley? Yeah, it's really nice. Yeah, that was a nice, nice pickup. You can't beat that, that's for sure. All right. Here is an absolutely stunning bracelet. Look at this. It's like enamel or epoxy, and it has the um, dried flowers inside. Yeah, it's beautiful. Uh, we're looking at a six and a half. Probably could go up a little bit more than that. The color is beautiful on this. Oop, didn't mean to do that. Gosh darn it. There we go. It is running. Don't see it signed anywhere. Thank you, Brainiac, for your bid. This is so pretty. Anytime I can pick something up with dried flowers in it, I will. Nice pickup, sweetheart. I turned it over. I don't see any marks, but you know what? Sometimes there's marks that I don't see. Dun, dun, dun. Very nice. Really, really pretty bracelet. All right, what do we have here? All right, next bracelet. We are at a 7.5. This is our clasp, 7.5. It is running. There we go. Got to make sure we keep you at the top of the screen. That new shadow at the bottom is brutal. We have a ring. Yeah, it is annoying. I'm not going to show the ring because I don't know where my ring sizer is. Oh, this is pretty, though. This is another bracelet. This is a Sarah Coventry. Look at the color in these. Look at that. Pink to purple to green. Look at those. Let me move this so you can see the white behind it. Isn't that beautiful? 
Sarah Coventry. She does have a safety chain still. Let's put this all together. And get you a size. This is 6.75. It is running. And it is Sarah Coventry. Quite possibly the most beautiful Sarah Coventry bracelet I've seen. It is gorgeous. Yes. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. Man, you guys let her steal it. Thrift and gold, nice pickup. What a beautiful, beautiful piece, boy. I feel like that is a really rare piece right there. I've never seen one. Absolutely beautiful. Wow. Yeah. Very nice. Ooh, that was a good one. That was a good one. All right. We have a Cameo Locket. The chain is 18 inches. Here is our clasp. Eighteen inch chain, cameo locket, it is running. She's pretty. Hey Mrs. Burkett, welcome in. Got a little bit of the etching on the top right there. Very cute. Karma. Nice pickup, my friends. Very cute. All right. Another beauty right here. Again, needs a spa day because I don't clean the jewelry. Little porcelain piece. It is running. That's going to come off with a good wash. Pardon me. Oh, this one's pretty. Okay, this chain is 22 inches. 22 inches, this is our clasp. This is our chain. This is our pendant. And it is also a pin. Here's the clasp. Really, really beautiful piece right here. And she is running for four. Thrift and Gold, thank you for your bid. So, I love this one. It goes really nicely on that chain for sure. And I, you guys know I love me a little chain tassel. Brainiac, nice pickup. So tomorrow night we're treasure hunting in one of the new boxes. Hey, RT. RT, I have to say to you... Thank you so good for, thank you so much for that wonderful 
review that you left me. That was very nice. I appreciate you. All of you who leave me good reviews and the personal reviews, it just makes me so happy. All right. We, oh, thank you. We are going to, oh, we are going to run this beautiful pair of faceted unikite earrings. They are stunning little pearl drop unikite and i'm not sure what that top stone is i'm going to be honest with you but these are gorgeous i might steal these i might take these and put sterling silver hooks on them for myself i just might do that dun, dun, dun. What do we have here? Oh, we have a Sarah Coventry. Let me get the pin closed. Looks like it's in pretty good shape. Sarah Coventry. This is cute. I love the turn on the leaves here. It needs a spa day. It's a little bit grungy. But it is beautiful and it is running for four. All right. We have a, another Sarah Coventry piece coming up. This is a Sarah Coventry cross pendant. There is no chain. It's pretty big. It's really beautiful though. Sarah Coventry cross pendant. Really, really great piece. Thank you, Brainiac. Appreciate it. I absolutely love Sarah Coventry crosses. This is the second cross I think I found. And boy, they sure are stunning. Nice pickup. Very nice. All right, another doozy. Let's get a length on the chain real quick. We are looking at 24 inches. 24 inches on the chain. This is our clasp. And got pretty blue flowers. It is not signed. I know. I love that blue. Thrift and gold. Thank you for your bid. Appreciate it. Yeah. When I saw the blue, I had to pick it up. Thrift and gold. Nice pickup, sweetie. Very nice. So tonight we're just chilling and going through my trays because I picked up a lot of fun stuff this weekend. This is really cool. The chain is 30 inches. This is our clasp. And it has these 
stations where the chain is wrapped in that tube. And then at the bottom is this really fantastic enamel. Let's see if I can get it open. Hold on. Hold on. Baylor. Baylor watch pendant. And the enamel on this is so pretty. So you're wearing it, you open it up, and there's the time. She is a running. Karma's purple, thank you for the bid. She's gonna have the magnifying glass and the time on her necklace. Even so, just what a pretty, isn't it pretty? Brainiac, thank you for your bid. I, uh, my jewelry guy showed it to me. I was poking around, I picked it up and I didn't realize what it was. My jewelry guy. We have here. Here's Clausenay piece. I'm not sure what this is. If it's like a scarf tie or what. Is it for a scarf? I'm not going to mess with it because I'm afraid I'm going to break it. But it is a beautiful Clausenay piece. And it has that gorgeous iris on there. She's pretty. All right, let's see if I can, I'm gonna try to test the stones in this. I don't think I can get to it. They're probably glass. If I can even get it out. I don't know if I can get it out. Hubert. I think those are glass cat eyes in there. It's kind of what it looks like. Uh, silver tone cross pendant with, I believe blue cat eyes inside they are running how you doing cubert how you feeling All right. I do not have a chain for this. Um, I have not checked the metal. This is a jade pendant. I did test this on the Presidium just now. This is jadeite jade. It is very beautiful. You can wear it either way. Man, that's pretty. And it is running. Beautiful jade pendant. We have ourselves another dried flower pendant. This feels like it could have been an artisan piece. 
It's got some either epoxy or something on there. Beautiful little dried flowers in there. Isn't it cute? <laughs> I know I got some really, of course I can, sweetheart. I got some really great stuff this week. I got some really great stuff this week. I sure did. The jade is running again. Thank you, Karma. Beautiful pendant right there. Love. Um, Vivian, you came in after I ran most of the glass. I had a lot of glass. We started the live off with a lot of glass. Karma, nice pickup, sweetheart. We are going to run this beautiful glass pendant next. Look at that flower. It is so pretty. It is solid. It doesn't have any nicks or dings or anything that I can feel on it. So pretty. She is a runner. Thank you, BBS. We got a first timer, everybody. Congratulations, BBS. Thank you so much for your first purchase with me. What a beautiful piece to win on your first time. Very nice. That sure is pretty. Let me get the bag started for you. Welcome to the family, BBS. All right. Let me see here. Awesome. I usually get a few. So I think this is petrified wood. It's either petrified wood or it's Jasper. But I'm going to be honest with you. I really do feel like it's petrified wood. There is no chain. Like I said, I think it's petrified wood. Love the color variations in this. So pretty. All right, let me check this guy. We have a bracelet coming up. It is a semi-precious gemstone. Let me see here. It is a canvas piece. Here's our clasp. I believe this is blue chalcedony. That's what I think it is. It could be also agate, but see that little blue dot right there? I think it's blue chalcedony. 
You can kind of see. Anyway, it's really pretty. So let's run that. And let's run it with... We're going to run it with this... Um, glass bead bracelet magnetic clasp so those are going to go together and they are running beautiful piece bbs BBS is racking it up. Thank you. All right. Next piece, what is this? I think that's Premier Designs. Let me get that hair off there for you. Premier Designs. This is, uh, these rhinestones are glass. I did just check them on the Presidium. Look at that beauty. Beautiful Premier Designs cross. So pretty. Okay. I picked this up on the off chance that it was garnet. And I think it is. If I can get a hold of the stone. Yep. Garnet bracelet. This bracelet is... Actually, this might be a anklet. It's nine inches. You could get an extender on this and wear it as a necklace. This is nine inches. This is garnet and amethyst. These round beads are all garnet. These square beads are amethyst. It is beautiful. So garnet and amethyst, it's nine inches, so it could be worn as an anklet, but I would say you could easily get a nice long, ignore that, it's really pretty. <laughs> garnet and amethyst, beautiful. BBS, nice pickup. Man, yep, I, I grabbed that thinking, you know what, I think that might be garnet. I'm glad I did. Nice pickup. Thank you. Oh, perfect, BBS. Perfect. All right. So I have another... Um, I have another magnifying glass pendant, but I don't have it on a chain currently. Um, but I'm going to show it to you anyway. So this is our magnifying glass pendant. This one's a little bit bigger than the last one. You're going to have to put it on your own chain. And she is running. 
It's really pretty. It's a nice big one. I'm telling y'all, I'm snapping them up. Karma, nice pickup, sweetheart. Yeah, it's very cool. <laughs> yeah. And sometimes not so old people, too. Karma, you're going to have a magnifying glass for every day of the week. Here are a pair of Coro metal clip-ons, little metal flowers. They are running. Coro metal clip-ons. I like these metal ones like that. Okay, this is cute. So I'm not sure of the stone this is. It kind of looks like turquoise. However, I cannot access said piece to inspect closer. So we will inspect it together. The chain is 34 inches. It does have a three inch extender. This is our clasp. Look at, it's a little bird cage. And I swear, Look at that bird. Isn't it cute? I mean, I guess it could be enamel, but, and he moves around. Anywho, I thought this was really awesome when I saw it. Yep. Thank you, Brainiac. Somebody who might be a fan. Very cute. Oopsie. Brainiac, nice pickup. Guys, I went to the post office today. Holy shnikes. The line was out the door. Oh my goodness. Nobody was using the kiosk. Everybody was standing in line. Like it was crazy. It was chaos. And I just walked in. I walked up to the counter. The people there, they know me. I asked for a cart. I went out to my car and got my, the, it's an Akoya Pearl, really? Went out to my car, put 209 pounds of jewelry in the cart, took it back in. They buzzed me into the door in the back. They took all my stuff and I didn't have to wait in line. I am going to buy the people at the post office treats big time, big time. Here are a pair of Monet earrings. And we're gonna run the Monet earrings with this Ann Taylor bracelet. Kind of mix it up a little bit there. They are running together. Monet earrings and Taylor bracelet. Brainy 
Zodiac. Yeah, they're awesome. I told you guys, I really, this, these are going to be next. These are super cool. Now I'm expecting a little bit of bidding on this one. Ugh. I took my chance today. And the reason why I take, took my chance is because girl, there is no playing nice when that timer's on. I'm just telling you right now. So this is about a 6.25. There's two of them. Let us zoomy zoom in. These are two vintage Whiting Davis Company absolutely stunning bracelets. That is one. That is two. I contemplated running them separately, but I feel like they need to go together. These are very heavy. They are gorgeous. Yeah, like... These are amazing. My mom found them. Thank my mama. She found them. All right, my friends, they are running. Two beautiful Whiting Davis bracelets. Beautiful vintage pieces. You are not even going to believe how heavy these are when you get them, Karma. And Karma... I almost brought these to your attention because I feel like they might be small enough that they might work for what you were asking me about. Because you asked me for sterling. I can do that. Absolutely. One's into Brainiac's bag and one's into your bag. Karma, thank you. That was very sweet. I hear it, girl. I hear it. Of course, you already know that because you're in here. <laughs> very nice. All right. So this is going to be kind of hard to show you guys. Um... I'm going to do my best. So first of all, uh, if I run this, it's not going to start at $4. Um, it will probably start at 30. Let me get a measure on it for you real quick. This is a crucifix. I'm sorry. This is a rosary. I say crucifix. This is a rosary. And from the back of the neck where you would think the neck would normally be. So this is actually, I think, the back of the shoulders to the bottom of the cross. We're looking at 39 inches. So this rosary is 39 inches long. And it is all glass. It is a four inch cross. All this is glass. So this is almost 40 inches of glass beads, my friends. So then the rosary splits off and then it splits off again. So what happens is 
they wear these, I think, around their shoulders. Yeah. Anyway, 40 inches of glass beads. It doubles up at the top to go across your shoulders. Um, give me just a second. I paid up for this just because I thought it was so awesome. Uh, I will run it for 30. So 40 inches of glass rosary. I believe this is for clergy to wear during um, services. It is absolutely stunning. Very, very nice. All right. Well, I mean, it fits right into this crowd then, right? Silly lady. All right, let's see what we have here next. Did I just see Tattoo Girl come in? I thought I saw her pop up. I did see her come in. Hi, Tattoo. All right. Um, anybody need a watch? Uh, Adrian Vitadini. Uh, still has the tag on it. I don't really know anything about it. It doesn't look like it's ever been used and the plastic is still on the back. Adrian Vitadini. Still has the stopper right there. And it is running for four. Brand spanking new. Adrian Vitadini. Um, I, I don't know. Um, probably we'll know. Uh, we might come across some tomorrow night. But my mom is sorting right now. So Monday and Tuesday or Wednesday will be good nights um, to figure that out. We, I always have watches. But I did not buy any watches at the swap meet. So the next necklace, the chain is 21 inches. It has a 925 tag. Let's take a close look at the clasp. It's a really nice chain. I did not test it, so I cannot confirm nor deny that it is 925. I just bought it, and actually I didn't even see the tag on it. So I just picked it up because I thought the chain was nice. So 21 inches, it is, uh, it does have a 925 tag on it, it is running. Um, I did not test it, so I don't know if it's 925. Hey, welcome in. And now that nobody picked it up, it'll go in my test pile. And next time it won't be $4. <laughs> All right. Again, a pair of earrings. These are not tested. They are lapis, beautiful lapis earrings. Lapis in every direction. Really, really beautiful. Yeah, they're gorgeous. And they are running for four. Yeah, they're, they are stunning. Look at all the different, every lapis you look at is a different color. Really, really gorgeous. BBS, nice pickup. Very nice pickup. My pleasure, thank you. Thank you for hanging out with us.
yeah that was a great that was a really good one um i would test those bbs i'm gonna be honest with you i think that there's a strong chance that those could be sterling i really do But I like to give you guys the opportunity to pick that stuff up for me. All right. This is another really awesome piece. It's going to be a Sarah Coventry. The chain is 21 inches, 22 inches. I'm sorry. 22 inches. Here's our clasp. Here is our chain. Let's get down to the pendant. Sarah Coventry. Check this out. You pull this out and you've got two pieces. This is a part of the, it hangs. So if you take this off of here, you wear this as a brooch like this. So Sarah Cov, or it's marked Sarah. It's marked Sarah here. And then you have your pin on the back. So if you decide to take it off of here, you're going to wear it as a brooch like this. Isn't that neat? Beautiful Sarah Coventry. So nice. Yeah, I haven't seen one like this before. When I picked it up, because uh, usually you, you know, you know, you can see Sarah Coventry a lot of times and you know. Yeah, I did not see that coming. Brainiac. A nice uh, pickup. Oh, here we go. This one's fun. I tried to pick, I picked up the wacky, some of the wackiest stuff this week. Thank you. Thanks for hanging out. It is, it is. Oh, here we go. All right, here's a nice big piece. So mostly I did not get this for the necklace as I got it for the pendant itself. The, um, the chain is 30 inches. So the chain is 30 inches. I think it's either, it's either acrylic or plastic, but this is why I picked up the necklace. Look at this massive Clausen heart. It is gorgeous. Like I'm telling you, like, this is why I picked the necklace up. It is really, really nice. Two inches across. Two inches from the crease right here. So, gorgeous. Cloissonne necklace, Let's see, Cloissonne pendant. I love this right here. And I love the different colors on there if you look at it. Very nice pickup, Brainiac. Do, do, do. All right, it's not going to fit inside the bag, but I'll do the best I can. All right, this next one is pretty cool. OK, 
Okay, I think this could be some kind of stone. It could also be glass. The chain is... See, what are we looking at here? 26 inches. Oh, I'm sure you are because there's been a lot of cool stuff. So 26 inches and check this out. I'm pretty sure this is brass, but isn't this awesome? So there is a chain. How fantastic is this? It is running for four. I think this is so massively cool. Isn't it awesome? Tattoo girl, thank you so much. I love it. <laughs> it is so cool. I'm telling you, I found some cool shit yesterday and today. Well, whenever it is, it's super cool. And I feel like Tattoo Girl just got something really, really awesome. Yeah, that's pretty fantastic. Love it. Hey! What's up? Trying to keep all my bags in alphabetical order. All right. So this is a kind of super cool um, rosary. Um, I paid up for this one. So this is going to be another one that I won't start at four. If you're interested, we can discuss. Um, we're probably looking at a $20 start on this one. This is um, from, the, from the back of the neck to the bottom of the cross is going to be almost 20 inches. So it's a 20 inch drop. Now this is where it gets interesting. This unscrews. You turn it over and you open it up. And I'm not sure if there's saints in here or what relics. It is very cool. So if anyone is interested, I will run that for 20. Bits from Saints, that's what I thought. It's really freaking cool. Thought that was pretty interesting when my jewelry guy showed it to me. All right. Yeah. That is so interesting. I might hang on to that for a little while. I'm going to be honest with you. Just because I haven't had anything like that before. I will definitely do that. Okay. I have a necklace. It is genuine precious gemstone it is let's get a length on this 
I believe it's Ocean Jasper. And it is all Ocean Jasper pretty much. It is 15 inches in length. Magnetic clasp. And look at all this beautiful Jasper. I think it's all Ocean Jasper and it is running. Very pretty. BBS, thank you for your bid. That is cool right there. Nice pickup, BBS. All right, what time is it? It is 9.09. Let's see, that was number 46. Thank you, BBS. Appreciate you hanging out with us. All right. This is a lovely piece. It is a beautiful glazed porcelain, or my brain's not working right now. Uh, it's about 22 inches. Yay! This is our clasp. It has a marking of some kind right here, but it's kind of hard to make it out. But look at these beautiful glazed pieces. Look at the greens in here. Every time I pick these up, every time I see them, I pick them up. Because I just love the coloring in this glaze. And I think I said 22 inches on this. It is so pretty. It is running. And it is heavy. AZ Insights, what's up? I was going to message you today. I was going to check in on you. I thought if I didn't see you tonight, I was going to message you and see how everything was going. BBS, fantastic pickup. Southern Circus, how are you doing? Hello, my friends. Welcome in. All right, I have a bunch of rosaries. If there is a rosary color in here that we, you would like for me to pull out and run, please let me know. There is glass in here. There is one of the, um, quadru uh, the quadruple interlink pieces that you guys liked so much the other night. See how it's doubled up on each side. We've got that beautiful blue with the AB. There's wrapped pearl. All gorgeous. If you want me to run one of those, just give me the color. And I will do that. Okay, stand by just one second. I need to grab another tray. Oh, that is good. Where is it? Okay. Oh, there we go. I found it. If anybody's interested in any of those rosaries, you let me know. 
All right. This is not signed. Oh, we're just running stuff. I'm towards the end. Um, everything. This is the stuff that I picked up from my jewelry guy. Not signed. But look at this. I have only a few more items to run and then I'm going to call it a night. Tomorrow, or no, tomorrow night is treasure hunting. Everything will start at $3. Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, we're bundling with $2 starts. How have you been, my friend? This beauty is running. Love the flash on this. Yep, I hear that. Abundance, girl. Abundance. I love it for you. I love it for any of us, as long as it's positive abundance and not frantic abundance. Brainiac, nice to pick up. Oh, oh my goodness. You have your hands full then. Well, I hope everything's going okay for you. We have missed you, my friend. We have noticed your absence. All right. I'm sure, yeah, we, will, we have noticed that you've been gone, sweetie. So we are going to run this brooch. And we are going to run it with this brooch right here. This is a crown trafari. So this one I've had for a week or two. And this one is new. So we're just going to run these two together. Crown trafari. This one is unsigned, but it's super cool. I think that's really neat. Thrift and gold going to take it home. I think she might. All right. Nice pickup. You are welcome. All right, I've had this piece for a while too, but we're going to run it tonight. I don't know if I've run it. I think I might have run it once, but I'm going to run it right now. It's 30 inches. This is 30 inches of hematite, and it is heavy. I have been doing well. I am, uh, I've got a lot going on too, but things are good and lives are good and I'm hanging in there. Just trying to keep, keep on keeping on. You know what I mean? BBS, nice pickup. This is fantastic. You are going to love this. Mom and dad are good. Had a yard sale this weekend. I am crushing my goals. Last Thursday, I beat my, I, I hit my goal of wanting to do uh, 200 pounds of jewelry on Thursday night. So this last Thursday during um, the five pound lots, we did 209 pounds. So you know what that means next, right? We're going to shoot for 300 pounds. I might be insane. Can you show us the big old medallion, the tattoo one? Of course. Absolutely. All right. This is a Bars. Um, I don't know 
what the MSRP was. $48 are the MSRP on this. This is a beautiful tiger's eye bars necklace with the tag still on it. $48 MSRP. It is running for four. It is pricey. Absolutely. Tattoo girl knows. And it is a, I've had this for months and I haven't wanted to run it, but I'm like, you know what? Tonight let's run it. Let's get it out of here. MSQ. Nice pickup. So three hundred pounds. Well, I'm not expecting you to buy three hundred pounds. I'm just expecting you to sell you guys five pounds at a time. <laughs> MSQ, nice pickup. All right. So, Tattoo Girl, they would like to see your very cool piece here. Isn't that awesome? Yeah, it's really neat. It is, it's really fantastic. Tattoo Girl, this was a nice pickup for sure. Yeah, really, really stunning piece. I think, you, I think you're right. I think you're right, Tattoo Girl. Really, really fantastic. Again, it's another one of those pieces that I am was super tempted to hang on to. Yes, I think handcrafted for sure. Okay. Uh, let's do a, a buyer's givey. Let's do a buyer's givey. And... I think, I think this is a Peridot necklace. This is going to be for one of my buyers. Get your booties in there. And then let's see what else I can find. Let's do a couple. Let's see. Oh, let's get in there. So I thought I was going to have so much jewelry that I wouldn't be able to go through all my trays tonight. And you guys cleaned me out. We went through like four trays tonight. And I'm talking trays that were piled. Like piled. So I'm going to have to do better. I'm going to have to get more stuff ready for you guys. <laughs> MSQ! Yay! Very nice. Let me grab another one. Let's do uh let's do this beautiful wrap bracelet. This is a really nice wrap bracelet. We'll do this too. Get your booties in there. Chop chop. It is gorgeous. All right. Come on. Get in here. 
Yeah, it's a wrap bracelet. I love these. They're super popular. All right, we're going to draw in 10 seconds. Yeah, it, you know what? When I first got them, I did too, but they're actually wrap bracelets. And here we go. Come on. Come on. The Holly Hag. The Holly Hag. All right. Thank you guys so much. You rock my world every single day that I have alive. I'm telling you. Like you don't even know. I am so lucky <laughs> to have you guys around. Um, let us see who we can go and visit. We are looking for somebody with low attendance, preferably under five. If you have a friend who is new that you know they're on, let me know. Um... I see Dawn Morning is on. She's got eight. If there's a suggestion, let me know. I think we might go see Dawn Morning. I prefer to uh, rate somebody who has a low number. Um, do you guys want to go to jewelry or do you want to go to uh, something else? Uh, the Gumby Man's on. Uh, there's a handmade soap show on jewelry. Okay. Let's see here. Do, do, do. Sarah Kuziak. Let's see if they're on. All right. She's got five. Let's do it. Let's go bless somebody like you have blessed me, my friends. I appreciate you. Let's go and hang out with Sarah and I'll see you tomorrow. Same time and much love.